what's up everyone welcome back to the channel thank you so much for clicking in my name is gohan and as you guys can see by the title of the video today guys i want to show you guys the the lineup that i took to be able to get my first ring of this season nine uh and from what it looks like guys this season's going to go super quick it's only three weeks um and here are the requirements or conditions for the weekend so pretty much if you're trying to play unlimited you can you would have to use um any michael jordan you have or lebron james whether it's dark matter ruby uh you know green uh, i mean green I'm, i mean uh, ambro whatever the color you would just have to have michael jordan or lebron james in your lineup um and everybody else has to be a ruby so if you want to use both of them one has to be like a dark matter or pink diamond and then uh the, the other one would have to be a ruby so anyways guys the reason why i'm doing this video is obviously because you know there is new people within the community that probably don't know what cards are good or what what players could help you out to get this uh first ring of uh limited so with that being said man um i do want to just mention if you guys like the content or if you help you in any way please consider subscribing to the channel also like up the video for the youtube algorithm but yeah man so here is the lineup uh let's get right into it um so these are probably the best rubies that, this up here um especially with this guy uh Thedious young and isaac bonga they're probably the best or if not you know the best rubies that you can get uh, Mobamba is still really, really good. Probably one of the best as well. Thunmaker, he's good. He's just, you know, I'm used to him. I like him. That's the reason why I keep using him on most of my lineups that I that I go unlimited. Or every time it has to be a ruby. But anyways, yeah, Isaac Banga, man. If you guys don't know about him, he is uh, listed as 6'8". He can run the point guard or small forward position. And he does come with really good stats. Uh, defensively, he's really good. Um, good speed. And he does come with 38 gold badges. Um, my Michael Jordan, he is, I believe, from like season seven, I believe. Season seven, maybe season eight, um, maybe even season six. I'm, I'm not, I don't quite remember, but he's really good. He is uh, a diamond card. His stats are really, really good. Um, and then he does come with 28 Hall of Fame badges, 16 gold badges. So he's really, really good. Uh, Didi is young. He can run at the at the fourth or the small forward position, and he is listed at six eight as well. Um, really good stats defensively. He's really good. He he has crazy animations, at least in my point of view. Uh, it does come with one Hall of Fame, and then he does have um, forty eight gold badges. So he this guy is you know badge wise he, he has them. He's he's there for you, so he's going to be really good. Thunmaker, he is listed as 7 feet tall, uh, really good stats, um, good jumper, so that's the reason why I keep using him. And he only comes with 26 gold badges, but to me, this card is really, really good, man. Uh, at the center position, Mobamba, man. Mobamba is the man. So, if you run him with uh, Isaac, or uh, yeah, Jonathan Isaac, um, they both go to Amethyst. I don't have Isaac and I'm not planning to get him. I don't feel like it's necessary to be honest. So this is, I, I just have Mobamba. But if you have Isaac, go ahead and uh, use him and they both get boost on under stats. So Mobamba does come with 30 gold badges. And again, he's probably one of the best centers that you can use for the weekend. So um uh, off the bench to be honest I, I didn't even use my bench i just have them just because but if you want to go ahead and, and use a good bench one of them is this kobe right here he's really good stat wise defensively offensively he's going to be there for you and he does come with 47 uh gold badges um and then penny penny hardaway six seven good stats i'm not a fan of his jumper but you know he's good and he does come with a lot of uh, a lot of gold badges 44 and then two silver um i just use whoever here just because like i said like i did mention guys i didn't really use my bench um also this guy he was a reward from like previous season i don't remember what season it was also this guy's well i believe he's like from season seven six or seven something like that um but yeah he's really good uh one 
Hall of Fame and 37 gold badges. But yeah, man, this is the lineup that, uh, that I got my first ring with. Um, is it going to be sweaty? I'm not sure, guys. It might. It was for... I think I had one really good game, and then the other ones were pretty easy. Um, but overall, man, you know, go and get yourself your ring. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching, man.